little sister to me. Her ex-boyfriend, Brandon Hansen, confessed, but still pleaded not guilty. If, if God hasn't left him, I'm not going to leave him either. It, do, it doesn't mean I condone anything. I just want him to know that I still love him. Damaged goods do not commit first-degree murder. His defense attorney blames mental illness and side effects from the drug Zoloft. They say first-degree murder is way too steep of a charge. His house is searched. His car is searched. There are no books, no articles on how to get away with murder, how to commit a murder, how to hide a body, how to clean up evidence. Nobody wins here. Both families are grieving. And, um, and my heart goes out to the other family. It's a cop-out. I think uh, the attorney is doing what he's paid to do. Prosecutors say the killing was premeditated. They say Hansen was obsessive, manipulative, and controlling, that he threatened to kill himself if Michaela left and lied that he was diagnosed with cancer to get her to stay. One second he would look a little distraught, and the next you look over again and he's smiling, or he's smirking at something, or he finds humor in any part of this entire process. It's absolutely reprehensible and it just shows his true character, his nature. Jurors will begin deliberations tomorrow morning. Hansen's defense urged them to consider a voluntary manslaughter charge instead of first-degree murder.